I'm about to drive for 7 hours to a foreign country to a huge event where I need to paint a lot of artworks in a very short period of time in front of a lot of people. Sounds a bit stressful. Anyways, let's go! <sighs> this definitely didn't look majestic. Ouch. Alrighty. I just arrived and let me just say that I expected that it's gonna be big, but this did the, the, the I am in heaven. I'll explain it all tomorrow. Dzień dobry. Yesterday I arrived to Poznań, which is a pretty major city over here in Poland. I am here because I got invited to this big event where I'm gonna paint for Kia. Kia, the automaker company, which collaborates with League of Legends. More specifically with the League of Legends Championship. I'm still not completely sure what to expect. Let's go there. One more thing. During the recording of my drone chats, I noticed this huge, apparently abandoned complex next to the rails. It looks absolutely beautiful and I, I am so tempted to go there and explore it. But I won't have time for that. So you guys, if you are from Poznan and you know the place, you know what it is, let us know in the comments below. <sighs> Kia, League of Legends. It is huge. Everything is so professional. I'm just a little bit stressed out. I'm gonna actually tell you a secret. Originally, I should have painted a car here. But as you have seen, there already is a customized Kia EV6, which is an electric car. So I'm gonna paint canvases instead. But to make it a little bit more interesting, I'm gonna paint five of them in three days. Okay, so this is my painting area. I just, I just, Okay, let's go. Huh, I kind of wish I had more light because... <laughs> so far so good. But right now, all these cosplay people showed up behind me. I guess there was something happening. My work on this project actually started three days ahead of the event with the preparation of the designs and also preparation of the canvases. You might have noticed that I already had my first lines there on the canvas. And that's because I know myself a lot better than I used to and I was fully aware that painting five canvases in three days with all these people running around me just wouldn't be possible. But if I have a good preparation and the first line's already there, the chances of success are getting higher. <laughs> I got good news and I got bad news. I love the painting, but I'm slower than I anticipated. Fortunately, my last two projects were actually acrylic paintings on a canvas, which is the exact medium I am using here, also with a little bit of spray paint. And that's great because I'm already used to this medium and the process. So it's almost 4 p.m. and I finished the first canvas. That's not bad, but I'll need to speed it up a little. That's right. I have to say that there is this certain magic about these trips where you have only one mission and one mission only. My body definitely didn't feel like painting another canvas right after finishing the first one. But with all the people around, I find it a bit easier to just push through. Math says that I need to finish 1.6 canvases per day. 
And I also need to prepare myself today, so this is a huge success. Day two, and we have a full house. There's a lot more people today. I set up my camera with this angle because I had actually no idea what is going on around me. I had to be fully focused on the paintings and I was wondering if people actually stopped by and look at what I do. Painting is going pretty well but also pretty slow, kind of stressed out about that. The reason why I need to paint five canvases is that each canvas represents a line in League of Legends and it wouldn't really make sense if we didn't have them all. Uh, sorry, I don't speak Polish, hey, but can, may I take a photo? Absolutely. Great picture. Thanks a lot. I knew that some people admire what I do because some of them actually stopped by and told me that what I do is amazing, or they asked some question, and that that always cheered me up. There was also quite a lot of people who were asking if they can buy the paintings. And that cheered me up as well. But don't get me wrong, I didn't really need people to cheer me up. I loved this. Some people might say that they they would have a problem with all these people peeking behind your shoulder, but I enjoy it. And by the way, to explain the event situation from the beginning, there were actually two events. This one, the gaming one where I am painting, and the automotive show, which I was fortunate enough to see on the day zero. Canvas number three. This one should be actually the easiest one because this only character is not a hu humanoid. It's a monster. And with monsters, Proportions don't matter all that much. With two finished paintings sitting behind my back, I noticed that people suddenly understood what I am doing a lot better. Because suddenly they could see the process and also the final result. So they know what to expect. But obviously none of them had the time to sit behind my back for three hours. <laughs> That's what these YouTube videos are for. To see all these hours of painting in a reasonable amount of time. And these thoughts in my head made me think like, how could I make life painting more interesting? more active. We have all seen caricature artists in the streets, doing portraits, but it still takes too much time to make someone stop and see the whole process. And I have come to a conclusion that the only kind of art I can perform that is fast enough are graffiti tags. Next time, if I get a chance to perform at event like this, I would love to paint the canvases, but also do tags for people for about, I don't know, two hours each day. I would love to see how people would react to that. is done and I gotta say this is intense but experiences are these are very important because they show you that many times you are just too much in your head sometimes you just need to let me put it this way fucking paint man and put all the bullshit away just do it Thank you very much. Alrighty, 7 p.m. That's 
9 a.m. There are still some cleaning processes in, in the process and I'm the first one here. <laughs> this is the last day, let's paint. At this point on day three, I knew that I'm gonna make it. But at the same time, I also knew that I can't slow down because the time is still against me. By the way, you probably noticed that I put lighting bolts into each painting and that's because the cars that Kia represents here are electric. Kia EV6 and Kia EV9. I'm gonna tell you a secret. I just had the strongest coffee ever and I'm playing metal in my in my earbuds. So I'm having a pretty great time right now. I'm on the edge of um, whatever. I find it a little bit rude to wear headphones at an event like this because it creates a barrier between me and anyone who wants to approach me. But also this was the day number 3 and I really needed to focus. And music can truly help you with that. Okay, I just got info that Katarina here, my favorite canvas so far, uh, will go away. Uh, it's, it will be a part of a giveaway in about two hours. wypompować najwięcej pompek na świecie jak Trindamer. Tak ląduje na górze. A Eryk posłuchał. Zin, nad którym jeszcze do, będzie pracował. Jeżeli akurat to jest coś, czym się interesujecie. Pytanie, szybka odpowiedź. Nagroda gwarantowana. A tymczasem zapraszam Was na kur... So, Katarina is gone. Struggling with this guy here. Last section of the last canvas and I'm done. This project was truly, truly special and I really enjoyed it. And I would love to know what do you think about this project. So let me know in the comments below and also don't forget to pick up your favorite canvas out of the five I painted. This is it.